We now begin with the dark and brooding tragedy of Othello. Moore. Speak of me as I am, but nothing extenuate of one that loved not wisely, but too well. For never was there a story of more woe than this of Othello and his Desdemon. No. <laughs> oh, Desi! Good production. What are you doing? Why do you all oh, steal my thunder? We left Jason on his own to research this play. <laughs> It seemed you looked up more in the dictionary and thought it was a place where you tie up boats. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, <laughs> that was so sad. Yeah, well, in this context, it's completely ridiculous because in the 16th century, the word more referred to a black person. Yeah, yeah everybody knows about that. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get the feeling. <laughs> We would probably we would have a little bit of trouble performing Othello more Venice because, as you know, the part is for a black actor, and as you can tell, we are like well, southern tier white trash Bucky watching types. <laughs> <laughs> racially challenged. Yeah, racially challenged. Thank you. So I'm sorry. Well, dude, I'm time out, time out, time out, time out. We can do this. There is no I and quit, and I've got an idea. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. Just watch. <laughs> Hey, there's no eye quit. No eye quit. There's two eyes an idiot. Yeah. <laughs> all right, all right, here we go. Oh, this is great. This is awesome. What the? Just left the front uh, <laughs> 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 Gotta fire the prop guy. They're real tangled. All right. Yeah, prop guy. We gotta hire a prop guy. Oh, okay. <laughs> Don't be afraid. <laughs> ah, it's cold. Well, it's February. It's not even at the right time. <laughs> I ran out of the TikTok. <laughs> what do I do with the clock? Just put it in your pocket. Well, that's how they all work? Yeah. That's how they work. Okay. <laughs> You're ruining it. <laughs> I got one for you. It's all right. Dude, what are you doing? I'm getting my more. <laughs> you are a more. <laughs> story of a brother by the name of Othello. He liked white women and he liked green jello. <laughs> yeah. And a punk named Iago who made himself a menace because he didn't like Othello. The more of Venice and Othello got married to Desdemona. He took up for the wolves and he left her alone. It was a Mona. A Grona. He left, left her alone. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't write a letter and he didn't telephone her? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Does the bonus she was faithful, she was chastity tight. The power of a duke. Yeah, she was totally white. And Iago loved Desi like Adonis loved Venus. Desi loved Othello because he had a big sword. <laughs> 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 And Iago say, I'm gonna shaft them all. How are you gonna do it? Tell us! We know a tragic flaw that he's too, too damn jealous. jealous. Need a dupe, a dope, a the kind of a schmo. So we found a chump sucker by the name of Cassio. <laughs> the and he blames on the Desdemona's handkerchief. And the devil gets to wondering just maybe if, while he's been out fighting, commanding an army, a Desi and Cass played hide the salami. <laughs> <laughs> salami! <laughs> So little twice as bad as disgrace. But there's Amelia at the door. door. We met in Act 4. Who said you big dummy? She weren't no whore. She was beautiful. She was clean. She was virginal too. So why'd you have to go and make a face turn blue? It's true. It's you. So what you gonna do when a fellow saying, Damn, this is getting pretty scary. Pulled out a blade and committed Harry Carey. Do that funky more thing, white boy. <laughs> And Iago gets caught and probably got the plea, murdered up his badge, and moved to Beverly. Hills, that is. 